Hey traders, we're gonna have a look at Facebook. In this stock overview, we're going to have a look at FB, Facebook. Before I start this video, guys, do not be placing a trade on Facebook or any market based on what you see in this video. I have no idea what is going to happen tomorrow. No one does. It's about probabilities, right? And and any given trade you take, you don't know what the outcome is that because every single trade you take has a random outcome built in with the probability of an outcome. And you never know which, the probability of an outcome is when you take 10 trades, 20 trades, that's when you can see the outcome, right? It's not about that one trade. No one knows the outcome of one trade or one setup, right? So, past performance, I think a few performance, the market can slap you hard. Trust me guys, I've been there many a times where I've been silly, I've been rushing, I've been egotistic. I've been a little son of a gun and the market has slapped me hard. So keep it under control there, guys. I I have excitement now when I, outside of the markets, but when, when I'm in the markets, I try to stay calm and I just, all right, cool. Let's bring this back down now. <laughs> but when I'm doing this, I'm like, hey guys. So anyway, guys, if you're after some free education and some and some coaching as well too, links in the description. Also, if you want if you want to book a one-on-one -on -one coaching call with me, links in the description as well. If you want to get my help personally, uh, on a one-on-one -on -one basis. So let's have a look at Facebook. Let's have a look at, let's see what Facebook's doing. So overall, Facebook has continued to, for the last few weeks, or for the last for the last few weeks, we've actually continued down. We're sort of trending down here in this sort of, uh, in this sort of, a, uh, sort of a triangle pattern. We're getting these lower highs, lower highs, small little lower highs, nothing to worry about there. We are getting like this little support level through here. Um, so you've seen uh, FB is actually holding up quite nicely where it is right now. We're not really, we're not really doing too much there. So we're doing that there. Let's actually just now what I want to do is I, I see that there. Let's go have a look at say the yearly chart. And the yearly chart we can actually see. Look what look what's happening on the yearly chart. So yearly chart we have a big upward trend, don't we? Big upward trend from there to there. If I bring up my other trend line from from there to there, I'm just going to just basically extend that through there to there. And there we go, right? So there we go. Support comes up and hit and comes up here. So let's go have a look at the weekly chart because the weekly chart will be able to tell us what's really going on through here. So the weekly chart on Facebook actually looks like it's developing a bit of a bull flag here. So if we start to get, it looks like it's developing a bit of a bull flag. So Facebook actually doesn't, there's nothing bearish about Facebook right now. It's actually looking quite bullish. So looking on Facebook right now, you can see it's actually developing a little little bull flag through on the weekly chart, and it may actually see some upside. Now there is a caveat to that, and that is this. If I bring up my line chart here, guys, and I squeeze my line chart up, you actually can see, actually not even, not even the line chart, if I just squeeze this up here, you actually can see this, guys. You actually can see that even though we were developing a bull flag here, we've gone up. We've done so much price in a short period of time. In the last six months, you can see how this has been pretty much parabolic. Uh, for most of the, most of the time, so therefore, guys, this is where you. This is where when the market goes parabolic, and I, I don't care what market it is, you just got to be careful about it. And when the market starts to spend too much time going up like that, it's a bit bit of a danger zone. So um, we are due for a decent healthy pullback, uh, but right now Facebook is looking really really strong here. Again, guys, if you're looking at this here, you can start to see that even if we do get a pullback, I believe Facebook will start to find a bit of support, probably around this trend line here. So you can see this support list. So if we do start to break down past these levels through here, probably going to find a bit of support there. Uh, but right now, guys, where is the trend? Who's in control right now of this stock? Buyers, right? Higher low, low, higher low, higher low. This here, this here could even just make a higher low through here, right? So therefore, if you want to be doing anything, you want to look for long entries on Facebook right now and not short entries. Uh, it doesn't mean go, I'm not saying go short right now. I'm not saying go long right now. I'm not saying, I'm, I'm saying don't go short this market right now because the probability, the probability uh, is that the market's still going up and the trend is up. Yes, we could get a pullback if the market starts pulling back, but um, but right now the trend is still in place. Trade with the trend. The trend is actually going up right now on Facebook.